Hello, how are you? Good. What is your name? My name is Paul Sims. Okay. And what do you do for the management department? I teach business communication, written communication. Okay. So before coming to Spears, where did you go for undergrad and grad school? So undergrad was many years ago at the University of Alabama. My major was in journalism and my minor was in human resource management. In 2011, I began doing graduate work at Auburn University. If you know anything about Alabama, I have degrees from the two rival institutions and I'm an anomaly, but that's okay. Several years later, I came here to Oklahoma State and obtained a master's in English and teaching English as a second language okay. in 2017. I started teaching here in 2018. So in the first several weeks of the course, we're laying foundations, things about how to interact with other cultures, how to uh, deal with conflict in the workplace, how to write effectively. And then in the latter part, we focus on reports, but one component we also emphasize is visual literacy and not uh, to help people understand how color works, how text works, the differences between the types of fonts, also that they can be prepared to move into the professional world and if they need to do these things, they're ready for it. Mm -hmm. The number one thing is to be prepared to think critically, to problem solve. I would say also uh, the big thing is audience, purpose, and meaning. Who is your audience? How will they receive the message? Why are you communicating with them? And what medium are you going to choose? And sometimes oral communication, verbal communication is the better choice depending on the situation. So conciseness is really key. The big thing for conciseness is it's not easy to start small, especially if you know you're going to be writing right in this space. Start small. Or if you just have to get it all out, that's okay. So trim. You look for things fluff like in order to. Uh, other things that don't really enhance the message is cut. One tip that I have one thing I've developed is especially when I'm really trying to make sure I know what the message says, is I'll read it aloud because some I will catch things. Because sometimes when we're writing, I, I in my mind I will see a the, but then I didn't type it. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so I can catch that when I'm reading. And just remember that you are when you're writing in an organizational business context, you are representing not just yourself, you're representing other people. So that's why the ethics matter, that's why um, the all these things about flexibility and decision making matter. 